Hi, hello, welcome. I really want to call the Verizon store on my phone. It once again has flashed, your phone is too hot, video may be reduced. And it's super annoying because I literally just started recording. I mean, I was on a phone call right before, but it, it's still annoying. Anyway, hello, welcome to the vlog. This week, and we're gonna call this a rest week, rest week, because I'm pretty much just planning, preparing, prepping, for all the rest of the things. Well, really just for next week. Next week I go to New York for my job. So yeah, I'm just planning prepping for all that. Plenty of things to do today, so I need to get in this gym. But I also, um, they made me a workout. Made me one yesterday and he made me one for today. So I'm super excited. Today I'm gonna bring my book in because I need to stay focused. And I wanna write down the things. So I need to do that. I thought I wasn't going to take my bag in, but I do need to take it in, which is fine. Because I need to take off my sweats to work out. So, so yeah, let's go. Let's go work out. I definitely think taking the InnoSupps Inferno, um, taking one pill instead of two was great for me because I do work out fasted. I think if you had a full meal um, and then you could take two, at least for, like for my body, headed home. It's 10 o'clock. It's all right. It's just 30 minutes later than I want it to be, but I tend to run my mouth. I, I do. Especially if someone calls me first thing in the morning, bro, we can be on the phone. Uh, because I'm like procrastinating and going into the gym. And then I'm mad at myself at the end because I'm just like, I've wasted 30 minutes talking and I could have been in the gym. Anyway, I'm headed home. Um, I just finished my InnoSupps video. InnoSupps. Innovation. InnoSupps. Get it together, Nicole. Um, I don't know if I pronounced it. Well, no, I did. I fixed my pronunciation, okay? Because one of the things in the contract was you got to pronounce it right. If you don't pronounce it right, you um, don't. You, they're not gonna like accept a video or something like that. So I just finished filming it. Um, I decided to make it vlog style because, like, going to the gym, like that's usually how I do my gym videos, are vlog style. So to kind of show like the different ways I was doing the thing, I'm also gonna do a little short, get a little, get a little um, intrigue, you know, get that going. And 
yeah and then I just need to edit it today and I need to put it up so since it's vlog style that'll also help me in the editing process and then I probably yeah I definitely need to do a voiceover so like to put like the information that I want to put in the video so I'm gonna do that um work out really good um you know they put my, my workouts together for me top tier definitely because I'm like okay I gotta do the number of reps he tells me to do and he's telling me to do like 10 12 15s and I would be doing like eights and sixes not gonna lie uh, <laughs> like I wasn't doing all that so and then like four sets of them so it's a decent amount like it's a decent amount of reps so I'm like spent at the end and then like I'm so I'm sore from yesterday but I did upper body yesterday so then and today I did lower body so tomorrow I'm gonna be sore on my lower body I just know because I'm doing more reps than I usually do so which is good that's good you know we're changing up we're doing things we're doing things how we probably should be doing them I just found this channel last night because of course I've been looking up so the new book comes out iron flame comes out well came out today oh so jelly of my friend Lauren she found the book, she found the book release. Granted, she, she found it like a week before the book, the book was coming out. Like, I was like, girl, if you would have found this, we, I would have took off work. We would have been going, but I had to work. So upset. She was texting me the whole time about the book release. Gosh, dang it. Ah, she had a good time, but whatever. No more, no FOMO because I'm getting, I got the book. I pre-ordered the book. I'm yelling. I'm yelling in this video right now. I pre-ordered the book. <laughs> It comes today. Actually, I need to check my Amazon because it said yesterday it said that it was going to come tonight, sometime tonight. So on Monday, it said it was going to come Tuesday night. So I'm going to double check because hers says it's not hers is not going go to go come to Wednesday. But either way, she went to the book release. So she got the book. So, um, so yeah, anyway, Iron Flame comes out. So then I, I was watching stuff on fourth wing, fourth wing is the first book. Iron Flame is the second book. Um, and I've been watching stuff on fourth wing. And so anyway, I found this girl, this like girl, she has like a book YouTube, which I feel like is really cool. Like I'm not, I'm not changing my YouTube. I'm done. I'm done trying to be like other people. We are planning productivity YouTube. Shawty, if you are here for planning and productivity, please subscribe to my channel. I do videos all about healthy, intentional living. And that is just living your life, living your healthy life intentionally. And to be intentional, you have to plan. But that's, I'm just saying. Anyway, um, yeah, I found this YouTube channel that I'm really excited to watch. I'm really excited to watch her. So I watched like a couple of her shorts and I was like, oh, like this, you, like you do, like cause sometimes I find people on shorts that only do shorts and I'm just not a shorts girl. Like I like short form concepts sometimes, but then sometimes I want to like watch a whole video and like listen to you ramble about things. So, um, yeah, so I'm glad I found her because she does both. She does shorts short form and long form videos and I'm like girly you gotta do subby girl she got a lot of subs though she already got like 50 55,000 so that's a that's a decent channel like so she good she consistent she putting out these videos go girl anywho so I'm gonna watch a little bit of her today super excited started listening to another book the second Crescent City House of which is this one Sky and Breath House of Sky and Breath listening to that one I need to read a book. There's like a physical book I have that I've had from a friend of mine that I just haven't read yet. And she was like, you're going to like it. You're going to like it. I just haven't read it yet. It's not a fantasy book. That's the problem. Like I, I particularly love fantasies, love fantasy books. So when someone gives me a book that's not a fantasy, I'm very hesitant to read it. It's fine. But I also have other things I have to do today. I have a whole full list of things I need to do, prep, plan, because... Yeah, we got to get ready to go away next week. Got to get ready to go away in two weeks. Got to re get ready for Thanksgiving week. There's so many things we have to just prep for. So, yeah, got to do that. Um, yeah, other than that, we're doing good. We're chilling. We're, we're vibing. We're loving it. Um, yeah, that's all I have to say. That's all I have to say. I'm going to go home, fix some food. Um, I do. I was like, do I have breakfast? I do. I have some breakfast items. Oh, I also bought, thank you. There was a hair in my eye. It was. I also bought some bagels last night. As a cream with cheese. I was really just, I'm really just loving bagels right now. And to be honest, it is what it is. Like, it's, it's carbs. 
I probably need to start tracking again. Not probably. I definitely need to start tracking my food because, girl, you just be, you be wilding. You be wilding. And I know I'm not getting enough vegetables in. I need to get vegetables in to get this weight off. And there's a lot of things I need to be doing. <laughs> a lot of things I need to address. So we, we're going to address it today because that's today. And that's what today is for. Tuesday is life admin day. Get your life together. So, anyway, um, let me get home, get some food up in me, and get to work. This is a good, this is a good week. It's a good week. I'm loving, I'm loving this week. I'm loving today. Feeling great. I do want to jump into my Christmas reading vlog because I just love the Christmas season and I don't know if we'll have time for a book like that. So regardless, I do need to read it soon. Hopefully it's at the top of First of all, I'll be feeling so good when I get things done. So good. Just words cannot explain. So finish ending my video for Inno Soaps. Um, I have to actually send it off to them. This is this is a real deal sponsor video. You know, the kind you have to send off to get approval to post. Real deal. We'll see how it goes. Anyway, um, it's like more of a, like a first impressions video because I literally just got the product. But I only had it for a week. So, yeah, like it's like first impressions. But I'm going to keep using it and keep talking about it because I really do like their supplements. Like I said, um, this one, the Night Shred. I live by this stuff. It's so good. Uh, it just works really well. Helps me go to sleep. Helps me wake up not groggy. Like quick turnaround type situation. And currently I get the minimum amount of sleep. So <laughs> it is what it is. But in like that night of shred like really helps me. Anyway, finished editing the video. Um, oh wow, I can see. I didn't mean to do that. But I uh, finished edit editing the video. I've said that like three times now. Um, I'm going to straighten up just a tad in my room. It's really not bad at all. I'm going to do a little bit of decluttering, pull out my bags that I'm going to start packing. Um, oh, and I'm going to pull out my prayer journal. So I've been wanting to make a prayer journal like for weeks now. I feel like I told my cousin about this and she's like my WAM partner, my accountability, my accountability partner. Um, I wanted to do this like, like a good month ago. I feel like I told her about this and I haven't done it, but I'm going to pull out the stuff now to do it. I have this happy planner book that I don't use to plan anymore. I do a lot of digital planning, but for my prayer journal, I want to write them down. So I like, I have these really cool rings. I love this cover. Like I love the little tabs. And then I also, I can still use the tabs cause it can be like per month, you know, and then you just fill in the weeks, like with the prayer and the prayer journal and all that. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm super hyped about that. And plus I have like add-ins. Like if you don't know anything about Happy Planner, basically you can buy the planner and you can customize it. And then you can buy like different add-ins to go with the planner. And I have add-ins that I bought, but I don't use the planner anymore. Um, and I was thinking about like just throwing them away, but then I can't bring myself to throw it away. So I have them. I'm not doing anything with them. So that's another reason why I'm going to use this because I, because I have the planner and pages that I can use for other stuff um but I just don't use it so I want to use it want to use what I have for it and I want to make this prayer journal so it's the I feel like it's the perfect thing perfect vibe so I'm gonna pull that stuff out so I can start doing that and I have an old prayer journal that is in a big binder and I think like condensing it to the smaller version is perfect for me at least so I'm gonna do that and then we're going to the bookstore so I got a gift card and I wasn't going to do this because I bought the book Iron Flame on Amazon. I pre-ordered it. First of all, now the pre-order has changed and I thought I was I thought it was me. I was like, oh, maybe I picked the wrong one. Maybe I picked the regular book. Nah, bro. I picked the Painted Edges book and now it's not there. It's not there, right? Like now it's like a regular Edges book. So I'm like, that's kind of whack. And then it says it's supposed to be delivered today, but it hasn't left yet for shipping and it's one o'clock it's supposed to be delivered by 10 it says okay we're gonna see so anyway uh i'm gonna leave a little bit early so i can go by the bookstore and i can spend my gift card and i can buy this book hopefully i can get a painted edges one but if not that's cool i really just want the book so i can start reading it as soon as possible so and like i said i bought it on amazon but it's not coming 
well, I, I don't know if it's not coming. At least it just hasn't shipped yet and it says it's supposed to come today. And to, like the book came out today. So um, so yeah, I'm just going to go to the to basically Barnes & Noble, see if they have it, use my gift card if they have it, and then just cancel my Amazon order. So yeah. Um, yeah, that's the plan for the next hour or so. So let me get out this stuff so I can do the prayer journal. It sounds like my video just finished editing. It, I mean exporting so i'm gonna go ahead and send that off super hype about it um and yeah that's it that's what you know that's what we're doing so we're, we're being productive on this day checking off boxes baby okay so this was my old prayer journal and this is what is going to become my new prayer journal so within my old prayer journal like i did this in a class and they gave us a lot of materials and like I don't know what these things would be called I want to say templates but that's not it but like readings and poems and inspiration um for praying basically like they gave a lot of this information so what I really want to do is take this oh, this is this is like a guide for the book like per month okay like prayer charts yeah like a lot of good information and I want to figure out a way to take it from here and put it in here so I'm gonna start I'm gonna flip through this a little bit better a little more and like really see what's in here like what things I want to keep and then I'm gonna go through this and see how I can transfer I only have about 30 minutes or so before I have to leave so I'm just gonna take the time to start because if I don't start it's gonna take me another month to do this and it's already been a month get your life together Nicole so anyway so I'm gonna be starting that way like I kind of have a base where I want it to be so first I need to go through see what I like what I want to take from here to put into here and then just start to deconstruct and reconstruct prayer journal in the making okay we're going on a book hunt I'm gonna do like a little little short video of this but <laughs> but um my book still says it's supposed to be delivered today, but it also still has not shipped. So we're just gonna go searching for the book. Um, like I said before, I have a gift card for Barnes & Noble. So I'm gonna go there first and hope to find it. Um, I mean, it is a highly anticipated book, but literally today's the first day it came out and it's a Tuesday. So I'm hoping, fingers crossed, praying to my Lord and Savior. That people were just gonna go pick it up after they got off work today. It's fine. <laughs> and so I'm going to the store before people normally get off work. So, <laughs> so yeah, it's gonna be there. There we go. And um, I'll have a copy to begin reading. Um, but yeah, that's that's where we're going. That's where I'm going right now to find this book. Amazon is trying to play me, and I really don't want them to play me. Like I wanted this book to just come to my doorstep, but I still ain't got the still ain't got the notification that it shipped yet and it's two o'clock and it says it's supposed to be here by 10 p.m so we'll see head it out now let's go yo here she is <laughs> the fact that when i bought fourth wing it was literally off of like one well i think my friend at work recommend recommended it and then I think I watched like a couple of TikToks or something. Like it wasn't even that big. Like I honestly, there was no book except for, ah, uh, no, actually Harry Potter. Like when I, uh, when I started reading Harry Potter, you know, I read them as they came out. And that was like the first time that I read a book and like I was in it before it was popular and like I was on it. And then with Twilight too, like I read those books as they came out. But after that, like I have, like no, those were so long ago, um, like a good 20 years ago. So uh, yeah, so now I'm just, I can't like, just to find a book that I really enjoy reading and like, yeah, it's a little cheesy, but guess what? So is life, like, bruh, we are not out here being perfect, perfect writers and speakers in our everyday life, but we still have real genuine situations and, and romantic encounters. And then I feel like this is what I love about the book. I think obviously I, you know, it's not perfect. Like there are things that can be improved, but as far as fantasy goes, 
it is good good fantasy reading so of course there's high expectations for the second book uh rebecca yaros i i just I, I hope you delivered you already have a good rating literally there's like ratings already for the book the book just came out last night at midnight granted there are people who got the book already they got it already from last night at midnight uh because i have a friend who did that <laughs> got her book last night so uh now she didn't start reading hers already because she had to work today but i'm sure people that actually did read it and actually did put ratings out there i mean but the ratings are good already 4.5 so rebecca girl deliver for me okay you better deliver for me i violence better be on it in this book that's all i'm saying <laughs> I want to read i want to read this book so bad <sighs> my daughter saw it in the in the seat i was good until she picked it up and she was like oh well let me read to you bruh ah the first page so my original plans for the evening have been canceled i thought i had choir rehearsal but choir rehearsal is canceled um so i'm debating on going out and spending money or staying in the house The debate, the debate, the debate. I feel like staying in the house and not spending money is gonna win. I really feel like it's gonna win, but I could, if I go out, I could get these little pretzel bite things, but if I stay in, I can, I can read and be productive. It, I don't know, I don't know. It's gonna depend on some things. It's gonna depend on, if they can go, it's gonna depend on if I wanna spend money, it's gonna depend on a few things. So anyway, I'm about to go to the grocery store though and get, um, all I need really, all I need is sausage for my daughter's dinner. Do I need rice? Nope, I don't need rice. I have rice. I just need sausage. Um, my sister actually brought me some ground beef, so I might make some burgers for myself. Yeah, it's gonna depend on those things. I, I, I need to stay in because I also, you know, I weighed myself and I didn't gain another two pounds because I keep eating carbs. That's a problem too, that I keep eating these carbs. So that needs to stop. So if I go out, they're going to a place, first of all, that um, has like beers and ciders, so I'm gonna have one of those. And then they have pretzel bites, and they're so good, so I'm gonna have some of those. And I don't need those things, because I'm gonna be spending money, and I'm gonna be gaining weight. Two things I don't wanna do. <laughs> so I don't think I'm gonna do it. I don't think I'm gonna do it. Um, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna do it. I think I'm gonna stay home. Oh God, oh God. Sorry, this person behind me just almost ran, ran up on me real fast. I don't know if it showed in my face the terror. But every time I have to like break and I'm normally not breaking, I always look behind me and it always just scares me just seeing the person come up fast. Anyway, I think I'm gonna not do it. I'm gonna not have the carbs. I'm going to this grocery store right now. I gotta get sausage. I'm gonna get uh, some buns for my burger because I already have ground beef because my sister brought me some ground beef. Um, yeah, cause I, and then I need I do need some vegetables. I'm, I've been slacking in the vegetable area, so I'm gonna grab some vegetables. I really just, I really want asparagus. Like, that's my comfort vegetable right now. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I think that's what we'll do. Unfortunately, I'm just gonna have to cancel. Well, I didn't, I really, I wasn't going to go. They had told me about it and I had other plans. And then I was kind of thinking about going. And then just now when I broke it down like that, like carbs and spending money, two things I don't want to do. I feel like that answers my question. Because I got goals out here in these streets. Goals for my carbs and, and for my weight and goals for my money. So, um, I, yeah, I need to do better. And it's, you know, it's, um... And not give in to the FOMO. Because all it, all it is is a little bit of FOMO. That's all it is. And I, I don't need to give in to it because I really don't need those things. Really don't need to have a cider and I really don't need to have any um, pretzels, soft pretzels. I have 21 days till my cruise. And next week I'm gonna be in New York. So 
we go in a couple places there that I'm gonna be eating food at, so there's that. <laughs> The sun is like, it was like in my, like while I was looking at my thing. Um, yeah, so I think it's, I think it's going to be a no for me. Sounds like a, sounds like a no. Let me go in the store because I actually am hungry. That's another thing. I'm hungry right now. Not good. Don't go in the store hungry. It's a bad move, but I'm about to do it. I'm about to do what I'm, what I'm not supposed to do. But it was because I didn't realize I didn't have any sausage, so. You know what? Let me. I'm gonna go in this store. I'm gonna get get home. I'm gonna fix something good to eat. I'm gonna read this book. I'm gonna save this money. I think this should be better. Um, just clearer than the other way. Uh, I just finished eating. Delicious meal. Ugh. So good. It was a burger, a double burger, and some vegetables, pretty much, and some potatoes. So. Really good, really filling, happy I did it. Now I'm gonna read a little bit. My WAN meeting is in 30 minutes. So um, my accountability partner should be ready in 30 minutes. So I'm gonna read for 30 minutes. That'll give me a good, good chunk of time to read. And then, yeah, get on the meeting. Talk about how the week went, goals for the next week, good stuff.